Hockey Night in Canada and the NHL on Sportsnet present the Stanley Cup Playoffs. Trying to describe it can make it sound like some sort of riddle. What can't be measured, yet can weigh a ton. What can write someone's story without using a drop of ink. So how do you calculate this challenge? Evaluate the burden of expectation. Classify the limits one must summit. One of the ways you measure it is with your memory. Our Stanley Cup champions. And the diamonds born from it. The polished history cut by their brilliance with simplicity and ignorance to ego. As the great Billie Jean King pointed out, pressure is a privilege. says you must win it for us be the next dynasty knows this may be your last dance has a penchant for breaking your heart and can leave a king seeking his crown It's that other opponent, the great equalizer, living everywhere, creeping through any opening, building with every game, intensifying with each play. again it has come knocking at the door under pressure an opening that says let me out pressure and let greatness in the stanley cup playoffs is next Love feels and looks a lot like hockey, doesn't it? Phil Rosenkowski is the producer who created that opening for us. Jeremy Winger was the editor. Beautiful start for game one. Toronto at Boston, the 2024 Stanley Cup playoffs. The 16-team field is set. Three first-round matchups are matchups like a year ago. Jets on a heater. So many great stories. Patty was in for the first time in 10 years. Ovi's back after a year out. Hockey Night in Canada presented by Rogers. Jake Allen is here for Kelly Rudy tonight. Jake, welcome again. We'll get your thoughts in just one second. Elliot Friedman, Kevin Bieksa. Kevin actually watched the opening. So Queen <laughs> and David Boy, you know really that good, was good. Really good, Ron. Really good. Kyle Bacoskis, <laughs> let's send it to TD Garden. Lots of news and notes. Over to you. Yeah, Ron, for those who missed it, William Nylander won't go for the Maple Leafs here tonight. Bobby McMahon is out as well. Brad Marchand on the line this week. The worst thing you could possibly